If you've been in real estate for longer than a day, chances are that you've heard about eXp Realty. And if we're honest, you've probably been pitched to join eXp Realty either through DMs, through cold calls, at events, everywhere. Every single real estate agent has probably encouraged you to join the brokerage at one point or another. Now, regardless of how you feel about eXp Realty this very second, I want you to withhold that judgment for the next several minutes as we go through and I share with you exactly what you need to know about eXp. Because I would much rather you hear about eXp Realty and what it's actually about from an individual that's had over 1,000 one-on-one conversations with real estate agents contemplating the move. Hey, Jaime with HaimeResendants.com where we have one of the fastest growing and largest real estate agent communities worldwide. All right, so let's get started. I wanna be super respectful of your time, so let's begin with the timeline. eXp was founded in 2009, and three short years later, it expanded into Canada. And three short years after that, in 2015, eXp launched the Agent Equity and Icon Agent programs, which drastically changed the direction of eXp Realty altogether, as evidenced by the following year in 2016, when eXp tripled the agent count growth in one single year. And if we fast forward to 2018, we see that eXp Realty officially opens in all 50 states. And what's truly fascinating is that by the time eXp turns 10 years old, it has over 25,000 agents in its roster. And now if we fast forward to present day, eXp Realty has reached 80,000 agents. And now you may be wondering, why is this happening? How is eXp Realty growing so fast? Well, there's several key elements to the growth overall, but first let's understand what is eXp. eXp Realty is the first cloud-based brokerage, which means the entire brokerage is operated online. eXp allows agents to become true owners and shareholders, something that wasn't seen prior to eXp. It's also important to note that eXp is not a franchise, it's a singular company. So while you may see eXp Realty brick and mortar locations throughout your city, that does not mean that they are franchise owned and that also doesn't mean that they're corporate owned. Those brick and mortar locations are leased out by individual agents or team leaders. And what's also important to know is that those brick and mortar locations are actually a holdover from when that agent was with another brokerage. Given that many team leaders and former brokers actually do away with their locations after they join eXp. eXp presently has over 80,000 agents and also does not do property management. So if you happen to do property management, this doesn't mean that you have to stop doing it altogether. It just means that that book of business that is property management business can't be run through the brokerage. It has to be run through another one. Now make sure that you check with your specific eXp broker to make sure that that's the case. Now I personally didn't know that eXp Realty didn't do property management when I joined, which would have affected me if I would have joined eXp Realty a few months prior given that I had a property management company at that time with over 125 doors. But thankfully I sold it months prior so it really didn't affect me. When it comes to commissions, eXp has an 80-20 split with a $16,000 cap. After capping, there's a 100% commission earned for the remainder of the anniversary year. So this means that as soon as the brokerage receives $16,000, you will have capped and you earn 100% commission for the remainder of the year. There's no more 80-20 commission split. Now it's also important to note that after you do cap, after you do reach that $16,000 cap, you do have a $250 cap transaction fee. So this means that on the transaction after you cap, you're only paying $250 versus doing the 80-20 commission split. And even that $250 cap transaction fee has its own cap of $5,000, which essentially means that after you cap, if you go on to do 20 more transactions, on transaction 20, 21, you're only paying $75 to sell a house. Now that's from the commission side. Let's talk about your standard cost, your standard fees. There's a $149 startup fee, which includes your first month's $85 monthly cloud brokerage fee. So for every month that you're a part of eXp, you're paying $85 a month, regardless if you sell zero homes that month 
or 100 homes that month, it's $85 minimum. And for every transaction that you have, you can expect to pay a $25 broker review. And for your risk management fee or your ENO, you're looking at $40 per transaction until it caps at $500. So let's go through an example. Let's assume that you're still on the commission split and you haven't capped. So let's just say you have a $10,000 commission. Well, under the commission split, you keep $8,000. Now from that $8,000, you have to subtract the $25 for broker review and $40 for risk management. Now notice that I didn't factor in the $85 monthly cloud brokerage fee because you're going to pay for that regardless. I just wanted to give you the exact number that you can expect to receive whenever you make a sale. Now it's also very important to note that eXp has a mentor mentee program for those agents that haven't had at least three transactions in the previous 12 months which means that if you haven't had at least three transactions in the previous 12 months, you're going to automatically be enrolled in the mentor mentee program. And for the first three transactions, it's going to be a 60 40 split versus an 80 20 split. So that additional 20% goes on to pay the mentor that you're going to be assigned that's local to you for the first three transactions and also is designed to pay eXp University, the actual program itself. Now, again, just to reiterate, this only applies to you if you haven't had at least three transactions prior to joining eXp. If you have had at least three transactions, you automatically are going into the 80-20 commission split. All right, so let's look at some special perks that you won't find in many other real estate brokerages and also don't fit within the commission and fees structure that we just saw on the previous slide. You can run personal transactions under your real estate license without having to pay a split on that. And the charge for doing that is a $250 transaction fee, which you can do through three times per year, which means that you can personally purchase three homes per year and only pay $250 per deal. You won't be paying a commission split. Now, another special perk is that you truly get flexibility in your business, which means that you can charge whatever you want in your business as long as you meet the minimum company dollar of $500 that goes to eXp. So as an example, if you have a family or friends discount, as long as eXp Realty receives $500 dollars you're free to do whatever you want which means that you could actually sell a house for free if you wanted to as long as exp gets its minimum company dollar of $500. Now, I'm not suggesting that you do that, but I want you to have all the information. Now on to equity. Agents can become shareholders at eXp Realty. So we are publicly traded on the NASDAQ under the ticker symbol eXpi. And there's five ways that you can earn stock for simply doing what you're already doing, which is selling real estate. You earn $200 worth of shares on your first transaction every single year. You also earn $400 worth of shares when you fully cap every single year. And on top of that, you earn $400 worth of shares when an agent that you sponsor into eXp closes their first transaction. Now, it's important to note that this particular event only happens once. This is not a yearly thing. Now, when it comes to the Icon Agent Award, you can earn up to $16,000 in stock upon the achievement of certain production and cultural goals within your anniversary year. Which, to put it in layman's terms, if you go on to do 20 more transactions after you cap, you will have reached the icon agent status. And if you go on to attend the two national events that eXp holds every single year, along with participate in icon agent events, you will become fully eligible to receive the $16,000 that you had originally paid into the cap to be converted into equity for you. And as part of the agent equity program, you can enroll to be paid 5% of every transaction commission with stock at a 10% discount. So the question to ask yourself here is how much equity Equity, how much ownership are you getting with your production at your present brokerage? And if the answer is zero, understand that you have options. Now on to revenue share. EXP's revenue share plan is one way that EXP rewards its agents for attracting new agents to join EXP. Simply, an EXP agent can sponsor a new agent to join EXP. Once the new agent joins, begins closing on transactions, the sponsor receives a percentage of the company revenue from the sales at 
activity of their sponsored agent until their annual commission cap of $16,000 is reached. It's important to note that eXp pays that share, not the agent. It's taken from the 20% adjusted gross commission income received by eXp and is paid to the sponsor agent monthly. So what this is saying is that from that 20% that goes to the company, eXp will pay out 50% of that. So 10% of the entire GCI gets paid back to the agents that help the company grow. And what you might be interested in knowing is the maximum potential annual revenue share per agent. And here you see that there's up to seven tiers of revenue share compensation. So as an example, if you sponsor five agents on your tier one and they all go on to cap at eXp, then you're eligible of up to $2,800 with each one of those cappers, with each one of those five agents. So if you do the math on those five agents that go on to cap, you're looking at $14,000 per year. Now, when it gets extremely fun is that if each one of those agents goes on to sponsor one agent a piece, that will lead you to five agents on tier two. And now if each one of those agents goes on to cap, you're looking at $16,000 from that tier two. So just from those 10 agents, you're potentially looking at $30,000. Now it's also very important that you read through this disclaimer because it is very important that you understand what's on the screen. All right, so now let's look at teams because some of you either have teams at the present moment or are looking to build a team rather soon. The team structure is pretty straightforward at eXp. You have the self-organized team, you have the standard team, or you have the mega icon team. So let's look at the self-organized team, which is really the most common one at eXp. There is no reduced cap for your team members. There is no minimum referral percentage required to the team leader. The team agreement is not required in writing with eXp approval. However, eXp does need to have the team roster. The reason being is because it's going to help from the accounting side and it's also going to help you see what your team is doing in terms of production. So in other words, the self-organized team is going to have the most flexibility and the most latitude to whatever type of team you want to run. Now, if you want to build a standard team, which is what a more traditional team looks like out in the real estate space, you can offer a reduced half cap for all of your team members as a perk, which means that your team members have an $8,000 cap instead of a $16,000 cap. Now under the standard team plan, there is a minimum referral percentage required to the team leader, and that is 25%. The team agreement is required in writing with eXp approval. The team roster is also required and needs to be provided to eXp, and there must be a minimum of $6 million or 30 closed transactions in the previous 12 months. Now again, this is the most comparable to other team models in other real estate brokerages. Now just so you understand, now that your team members have a half cap of $8,000, they are no longer eligible for the Icon Agent Award. That's only eligible to those agents with the $16,000 cap. Now, if we look to the Mega Icon team, we see that there's a reduced quarter cap for team members, which means that it's no longer a $16,000 cap or even an $8,000 cap. It is now a $4,000 cap for all of your team members. Now here as well, there is a minimum referral percentage required to team leaders, which again is a minimum of 25%. The team agreement is required in writing with eXp approval. The team roster is required and provided to eXp. And there is a minimum of $40 million in sales volume, 175 closed transactions, and 10 capping team members in the previous 12 months. So it's pretty obvious, but it's worth noting that this is reserved for those larger teams out there. Now when it comes to a husband and wife team, that is called a domestic partnership here at eXp, which means that a husband and wife can work as a domestic partnership working towards one singular cap. Now at eXp, you also have the opportunity of securing affordable health care. So the one thing that I do recommend every single eXp agent do is to go to exphealthcare.com and book an appointment with the professionals and have them map out what healthcare coverage could look like for you. I personally Firstly, am enrolled in this healthcare given that I compared what my previous healthcare coverage was with what was being offered to me and it just made a ton of sense for me to make the move. And something that we must address as a real estate brokerage is how much real estate does eXp even sell? And as you can see, eXp is ranked number one in several categories on the 2022 Real Trends 500 report. It's the number one independent brokerage in the United States. It's the number one mover in transactions 
transactions is the number one mover for sales volume and percentage over a five-year period. And now when it comes to sales volume overall, not just factoring in independence, it's number four. Now keep in mind, this was all achieved within 13 years. Now let's look at some EXP partners and really the best way that I can illustrate the partners since there's so many is each one of these partners is either going to save your clients money, is either going to save you money, or is going to make you money. Those are the three options. So some examples of how EXP partners are going to save your clients money. Take a look at Young Alfred with the home insurance. Take a look at America's preferred home warranty for home warranty. Check out Curbio for pre-sale renovation so your clients can net more money when they sell. Look at Utility Connect for move-in services and so on. Now agents, how you save money is by going through Agent Healthcare by Clearwater, using the CE Shop for agent education, using the EXP Brand Store for official EXP branded merchandise, and leveraging success coaching for agent coaching. And now how you as an agent make money is by leveraging the EXP partners such as America's Preferred Home Warranty where you get paid when your buyer purchases this home warranty. You can also leverage currencies direct whenever your client needs to exchange currency. And something you as a real estate agent really need to focus on when you're making your next real estate brokerage move is the technology. At eXp, we have eXp Enterprise, which is your hub for your entire business. This is where you can look at your commissions. This is where you can look at your sales. This is where you can go to the brand shop. This is where you can go for real-time information of your business. We also use SkySlope for our transaction management. This is what we use for signature execution and submitting all of our documents for review. So whenever we have a transaction, everything gets uploaded to SkySlope so it gets reviewed and we're able to correct anything that comes up. We also have Workplace by Facebook where every single eXp Realty agent can be found. Now we also have a very powerful CRM which is called KV Core. With KV Core, you get your website, you get your email autoresponder, you get your text autoresponder, you get landing page generators, you get squeeze page generators, you get everything that you'll possibly need to market your business all on one platform. And you also get a branding and marketing center for your real estate business. Now if you're interested in joining eXp XP Realty understand that you don't have to go it alone. You get the option of selecting a sponsor when you join EXP. And having spent years at EXP and spoken with a ton of sponsors, I can tell you that there's four categories of sponsors. Number one, there's the type of sponsor that will do nothing for you. There's a sponsor that as soon as you write their name into the blank, they're gone. They're sponsoring and leaving. There's really nothing that they can add to your business. The second type of sponsor is a sponsor that will provide you information that's going to provide education that's going to help you from giving you knowledge and giving you experience and really help you with that education component and the third type of sponsor is one that is willingly giving you their resources that type of sponsor will share their ad copies their scripts their funnels their actual resources with you to help you. Now, 99.99999% of EXP sponsors fall under those three categories. They're either gonna give you nothing, <laughs> or they're gonna give you education, or they're gonna give you resources. Now, the fourth type of sponsorship that doesn't exist anywhere else is under the agent first group, the group that I started. Now, this type of sponsorship is the done for you sponsorship, where we do your video editing, where we do your lead generation, where we do your KV Core setup, and a lot of other done for you services, such as your social media marketing. So just be mindful of your sponsorship because once you select your sponsor, you can't change. Now, if you're interested in learning more about eXp or about the agent first group then i'll leave the link down below but also don't forget to support our sponsor the subscribe button